This one question is literally gonna be what skyrockets your music career and your life to the next level. But before we go into that, I am going to make you a promise. I'm gonna promise you that by the end of this video, you're gonna be so fucking fired up that you're gonna go take action immediately and you're gonna change your life forever. Let's dive in. So before going into what the question is, I'm gonna just give a little bit of background. I got asked this yesterday on a coaching call and I wanted to share it with you because I think it's so profound because it took a lot out of me to answer it and it drew a lot out of me. So I wanna, I wanna share that with you. So I was asked on a coaching call, Lee, what gets you to wake up every day and do what you do? What's the emotional driver that gets you out of bed every day? And it's a powerful question that I don't think I ask myself enough. And it's, it's, it's something I realized that, that if I think about it and really let it sit in there, I think about the entire story of everything. When I was super young, like a kid, like six, seven, eight years old, as far back as I can remember, I, I struggled. I struggled in school. I struggled because I felt that where I was and the path I was on and what was happening just didn't fit with me. I felt like I needed more. I felt like I was boxed in. I knew I wanted to have power and control in my life and I knew I wanted to live my life with purpose. And I knew that something else was set out for me. And so what gets me out of bed every day is really just wanting to do what the fuck I want to do in my life. Because I went and woke up for years every single day not wanting to do what I wanted to do with my life not getting to do what I wanted to do in my life, right? I was in school for 18 years. 18 years, I'd wake up and say, I don't want to do what I'm about to do today. A majority of my day will be spent doing something that is not aligned with me and my purpose. I'm going to grind through it, but I knew I had more to live. And I knew that when I was like done with school, I wasn't going to just go get another nine to five. I wasn't just going to go live that life. There was more meant for me. Not that there's anything wrong with getting a nine to five. It just not for me. I wanted to go out and do something else. I just didn't want to be told what the fuck to do. I wanted to do me. And... Be honest with you, <laughs> I'm living the life of my dreams. Not with every single aspect of it. There, there is a lot of things I want to do more of, but I'm on the path now, right? I got shit rocking and rolling now. When I wake up, I'm up at five. I wake up. I'm amped. I get hyped. I'm ready, blast some music, coffee, water, we get to work because I wake up every day and I'm excited, I'm, I'm juiced. I'm literally excited to wake up every day because I set a very clear intention for myself years ago. I wanna wake up every day and I wanna, I wanna wake up every day excited, I wanna wake up every day with a purpose. And here's what gives me that purpose. I wanna make music, and I want to work with other people and help them make music. That's what I knew. Was that going to be me as a producer? I wasn't sure. Was that going to be me as a mix engineer? Was, I'm not sure. A songwriter, whatever. I don't know. All I knew is I wanted to help people with their music. Just didn't know how. Was it going to be mar just marketing stuff? I don't know. I didn't know at the time that I had these thoughts. I just knew I wanted to help other people and work with other people and drive other people's career forwards. Drive other people's music forward. Drive their creativity and inspire people. That's what I knew. That's what I knew. So every single day I've been working my ass off to get that life to happen and it's now happening. It, this all just started for me like not even that long ago. But now I'm living it because I know 
I knew years ago the answer to the question that I just asked you on this video. What gets you out of bed every day and is the emotional driver for you to do what you do? Simple as that. Ask yourself that. Think about that. Meditate on that. Marinate on that. I want to wake up every day and say, fuck you to the people that doubted me. Fuck you to the system that's trying to hold us back and hold me back. Fuck you to the enemies in my own head. I want to do me. I want to be a legend. I want to be great. And you know what? That's on you and it's on me to do that. It's on you to do it for you. It's on me to do it for me. It's up to us. It's, it's our lives that we have to impact and change. It, 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 ain't, it ain't anybody else's responsibility to do that. It's on us. So we got to do that. Every day. And like you can wake up and make decisions that are either going to make you weaker or stronger. Like I'll be fucking honest with you right now. Last night, my cousin was in town. My cousin Thomas Levy. Haven't seen him in a long time. It's obviously a bet that I'm going to I'm gonna go kick it with him, right? We went to have sushi. Kept on my diet, by the way. Um, but yeah, we did have sushi. And he came over to the crib. We sat down. We talked for a while. And I, I didn't get to bed as early as I might have wanted, right? I had to read my 10 pages still. I was sitting right there on the couch reading my 10 pages, falling asleep on the pages. I was reading Relentless by Tim Grover, an amazing book, of course, one of my favorites. It's my Bible. <laughs> and uh, I, just, I, I just went to bed later than I wanted. And I still woke up. I woke up today, five o'clock, alarm goes off. I'm like, shit. I'm gonna be honest with you, I stayed in bed for a few more minutes, like five more minutes. But I said, fuck it, man. I gotta get up. I gotta do this shit. I gotta get up and live my purpose. I woke up excited and this video I'm filming right now, I didn't even want to film this. I was like, bro, I don't even want to do this video today. But that's not how the fuck I live my life. I don't wake up and do what I want to do and do what I feel like doing. Now, fuck that. How am, I gonna, how am I going to live my purpose if I just do what I feel like doing all the time? Like, fuck, man. Like the world, is it, 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 it gets you all pressed up on being too in tune with your emotions. Like you should be in tune with your emotions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, God damn it. Like, don't be a slave to it. Like, like, like real shit. Like, don't, don't be a slave to, to, to all this shit out there. Everything out there is basically trying to poison you. Everything that we see damn near, it's like 85%, 90% of the information we intake is trying to fucking poison us and hold us back. So I woke up and said, fuck it, I'm filming the video. Now, now guess what? Look at me, I'm fired up. I'm so happy I forced myself to film the video because I live my life with purpose because I wake up every day knowing what's the emotional driver that gets me out of bed every day. See how I said that though, the emotions thing? You want to be tapped in with the emotions that are going to get you moving, not the emotions that are going to hold you back. So, you know, with these fucking videos, there's always that CTA call to action. Subscribe, like, I don't give a fuck about like, subscribe, follow me. Fuck that. Here's what I want you to do. Here's your CTA for this fucking video. Go be great. <laughs> Go be the greatest version of yourself. Because the world doesn't need any more sad, depressed, overweight, fucking weak ass people. We got enough of those right now. We got enough of those. The world doesn't need any more music artists that push negative messages. The world doesn't need any more music artists that just keeps poisoning the youth and poisoning the rest of the world. The world needs more strong people. The world needs more warriors. The world needs more people that are going to make it a better place.